I'm just here trying to go ahead and take care of my people, that's the goal for show. Yep. Trying to go ahead and put steaks on my plate and my mama's plate and now you know. Uh -huh. Trying to get, yeah, my pops up in the whip. What's good, YouTube? This is your boy, Watts, back with another video for you guys. Now, we got some interesting news today. Hashtag 2K ratings. Now, if you don't know what hashtag 2K ratings is, today was the official day they finally dropped some screenshots. Now, this is not just screenshots of in-game. This is screenshots of the players. Ratings, of course. You know, you know what we talk about. But yeah, we are talking about players' ratings. They just did the actual live release with Anthony Davis, Ryan 2K, and LG. They did a live release speaking of like the top 20 players and also as well as in the top 10 players and the rookies, of course. I think the top five, maybe 10 rookies or something like that. But we're gonna get into it. We're gonna talk about a few of the players itself. Do I think it was a good idea? For some players have certain overalls do i do i not think I, I don't know you let me know in the comment section below what do you guys think so far as far as in the 2k ratings in regards to certain players having higher rates than others or lower rates than others i don't know you you talk to me but let's go ahead and get into it we can waste no time you feel me you know the vibes out the gate these are the top five rookies from the nba draft zion williamson at a 81 Ja Morant at a 79. RJ Barrett at a 78. DeAndre Hunter at a 77. And Darius Garland at a 77. Now, I was expecting them. I was also I was pretty much giving the green light there. You're gonna give Zion an 80 to 81 to 82. Preferably, I would say to 80, but they gave him 81. Um, this is not full attributes as far as in the statistics of what is he going to be able to do. Um, so 81 overall, that's pretty much the average of what they give the, the rookies anyway. 79, Ja Moran at a 79, that's okay. But in his defense, he said, no, he said, disagree, let me work for mines. So Ja is not agreeing with his overall rating, obviously, at a 79, but that's the average of what they base the rookies around anyway. Um, 80 to 70s below and so on um but hey we're gonna we gonna see what these rookies can do Darius Garland at a 77 Hunter at a 77 RJ Barrett at a 78 um like I said all these guys that's pretty much the average for the rookies what do you guys think let me know in the comment section below what do you guys think about the actual overalls for the rookies that's pretty much about average Zion at an 81 because he's number one overall he's number one pick you know pretty much what they're gonna give him any goddamn way boom Jimmy Butler at an 88 overall. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Do y'all think Jimmy deserve higher? 88 overall is not bad. Um, I say get that, get that man Jimmy. Get that man Jimmy a 90. I mean, what does he have to do to get his 90? Let me know in the comment section below. Ben Simmons comes out with an 87. That's tough. That's tough. I mean, I guess if Ben if Ben Simmons was to develop a jump shot, that 90 or that 88 or that 89 probably looked nice on him. I think that's what's missing. That's pretty much what's missing out of Ben Simmons' game is that definitely that jump shot for sure. That jump shot. Don Mitchell at an 88. Don Mitchell at an 88. Now this is not bad at all. Low key, his last playoff performance was way better than this year's playoff performance. So, at an 88, a standard, um, you know, I, I, I would say probably an 87, 86, but 88, you know, a hey, 2K's, 2K's. I mean, he's doing his thing. I get it. He's doing his thing. That's about that's about the ways right there. But we'll see how he do, um, and we'll see his actual attributes and actual badges in the game when it when it drops man cat his 90 carl anthony towns comes out with an 89 overall do you guys agree give give that man his 90 i mean he was he been balling bro the fact that when we look at a player that i'm going to definitely talk about to understand be like okay even though we know but still all in all 89 for cat we got westbrook at a 90. now westbrook at a 90 that's that's, that's Straightforward, standard, not bad at all. I'll, I'll accept that. Um, you know he's on the Houston Rockets now, so it's gonna be interesting to see him and James Harden go to work together. Um, dominant ball handler, dominant offensive player, got some slight defense, same as James. But as far as in that, Westbrook at a 90 overall, that's straightforward. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. 
James Harden comes out to Big Man 96. <laughs> yeah, I get that to him. Last year's MVP. Yeah. Get that to him, right? Get that to him. Next up on the list, we got KD. You know he over there in Brooklyn coming out of the 96 as well. KD out of 96, that's fair. Um, what was he, 95 last year? Or 90, whatever, whatever one of those. But that's fair, 96, that is fair. Anthony Davis, a 94. Now, what do you guys think about AD at the 94 overall mark? Now, like, I, and this is what I'm saying. Look, I know he's, a, I know he's on the cover. I know that. I know that. My only thing is, bro, is Cat's been playing almost all year. AD sat out half the year. Come on, 2K. I get that he's on the cover. Let's make, let's show some shine. And this is a big, it's a big deal, especially with the trade. It was a big deal. Come on, man. Don't do Cat like that. But AD has up at a 94. Kawhi comes out at Kawhi comes out at a 97. Well deserved, hands down. MVP, Finals MVP, champ, hands down, well deserved. Now he's in LA as a clip with Paul George. That's gonna be something interesting to see. And yeah, that's gonna be lit, man. And of course, the final, we want a bigger image. We want a bigger image of that one. Let me see if I can get a bigger image. Boom. And of course, the one, of course, the one and only LeBron James. Coming out at 97 overall. They said he's the top, top overall player in 2K20. What do you guys think about LeBron James being a 97? I don't agree with this, but I'm gonna let it slide. I'll say get that man a 96, make Kawhi 97. He's a champ. At the end of the day, he got his ring. I get that he's on the cover. Let's make, let's show some shine. And this is a big, it's a big deal, especially with the trade. It was a big deal. Come on, man. Don't do cat like that. But AD has up at a 94. Kawhi comes out at, Kawhi comes out at a 97. Well deserved, hands down. MVP, finals MVP, champ, hands down, well deserved. Now he's in LA as a clip with Paul George. That's gonna be something interesting to see. And yeah, that's gonna be lit, man. And of course, the final, we want a bigger image. We want a bigger image of that one. Let me see if I can get a bigger image. Boom. And of course, the one, of course, the one and only LeBron James. Coming out at 97 overall, they said he's the top, top overall player in 2K20. What do you guys think about LeBron James being a 97? I don't agree with this, but I'm gonna let it slide. I'll say get him in a 96, make Kawhi 97, he's a champ. At the end of the day, he got his ring. Lakers didn't make it to the playoffs. Brian got hurt. I get, I mean, what, what are you basing it off of? But I get it. Kawhi, and that's why they kind of gave them both the same overall. Kawhi and LeBron at a 97. You know what's interesting though? We have not seen the MVP overall yet. Greek Freak. We haven't seen them drop his rating. Unless I missed it. Did, they, no, they didn't do it right. I don't know. His overall would be Antetokounmpo with overall with him being the MVP. Can he get to that 97 mark? Can he get to a 96? I got a feeling that they're gonna make Greek a 96. Oh, the motherfucker, I, Jeez. I got a feeling that they're gonna make him a 96 though. I really got a feeling they're gonna make Greek a 96 with him being the MVP. Um, besides that, man, this is your boy, J Watts. I just want to talk to you guys about the 2K ratings. If you guys want to talk about 2K ratings on Twitter, make sure you guys follow me on Twitter, RJ Watts TV. Also, you hashtag 2K ratings and 2K gonna, gonna rock with you too. So pretty much it's live on Twitter right now. Everybody's talking about these overall ratings for these players. Stay tuned for more 2K20 news as well. Let's get on we rocking to do. Hit the thumbs up button if you're new. Subscribe, join the Lace Up crew. Comment in the section below what you guys think about the whole overall overall experience. Yeah.